don't know how this pool called the Great Bath was used, but we do know that this city was planned and laid out while the Greeks wandered in small tribes, just a band of itinerant merchants. Wait, do you hear that? Listen. Yes, the Indus Valley people of nearly 5,000 years ago installed modern plumbing in their homes, something most people didn't have until the late 20th century. And they mastered other forms of hydro engineering, underground pipes, sewage management, kitchens with running water. They had dentistry and standardized measures for the tiniest quantities. They were great sculptors who introduced natural reality into the three-dimensional depiction of the human form. They had writing and hung signs on buildings, but we've yet to understand their meaning. They used dice to play games of chance and wild away their evenings with board games. And there's something curious about them. They left no depictions of war in their art, nor large caches of weapons. There's no evidence that their meticulously planned cities were ever burned to the ground by enemy invaders. In the study of their contemporaries and human history generally, this is most unusual. This figurine is one of the only surviving remnants of their civilization. And yet, they were as real as we are. Their moment as real as ours.